Hi everybody. A couple great articles out on Bitcoin today on Natural News. One of them is called How the Looming Bitcoin Crash Will Be Exploited by Globalists to Outlaw Decentralized Cryptocurrencies. The other one, the Bitcoin Bubble Explained Understanding the Mathematics of the Inevitable Bitcoin Crash. So, you know what I'm going to say? We've been learning about all the lies that have been told to us our entire lives. And at the end of the day, there's not much real left, is there? Why would you want to invest in um, internet currency? It doesn't make any sense at all. To me, it's just another fiat currency. If you want to barter with a, uh, a buyer and a seller want to barter, you can use anything. You can use your word even, you know, to make the exchange. So it doesn't have to necessarily be Bitcoin. It can be anything, right? And so I don't think that a person should be swapping hard assets for assets that actually really there's nothing there. That's just my opinion. And I think at this time, if we are swapping hard assets, for these imaginary assets or fiat currency, we're just falling right into the trap of the people that have most of the money today. And if we think that they're giving up control that easily, um, then I think we're about to be deceived. Yeah, they're not going to give up control. There's no way. There's no possible way. If people won't get together and boycott all these financial institutions, what makes them think that they're going to be able to take over with Bitcoin? They're not. They just can't get enough people together, okay, to, to have the power that the other 1% has. And I think at the end of the day, you know... A lot of people are going to realize the best thing to do is boycott these institutions. And um, you don't have to get violent. Just boycott them. Shut them down. If people would just stop dealing with corrupt institutions, the world would be a so much better place. And um, also, people have to start living within their means, and they're not willing to do that, so... I don't know what's going to happen, but I don't think Bitcoin's it for me. Anyhow, thanks for watching. I'll post links below.